From the QBC, putting cowards where they're supposed to be. If I don't know you, face me, don't come close to me. I got too much to with that. So I'm in the third degree. So this is the time I got kidnapped by Flea Lord and driven to Far Rockaway, Queens. People have begun taking shots at Flea in the days leading up to my trip to New York. A so-called diss record and allegations of ghostwriters. Do you all not see he feeds off this shit? But y'all gonna have to show me the proof because I still regard Flea Lord as... The most untamable, hardest working MC in the game. But it was clear to me that Flea Lord had no interest at all in furthering the negativity. He didn't want to talk about the distractions. Only his work to get his team to the highest levels. Get him out the streets. Start helping these cats provide for their families. And now he was home. Make it feel like 93. All kind of heats and trees stuffed in the seat. Yeah. Rolling popcorn gelato, my block on the bottle. Stay about the way for you get top from my hollow. Twisting up cauliflower, everything's down. You a fake nigga hating on the real nigga talking. Once it hits your brain, it's gonna lift you like the crane. Have your phone. Everything, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, that's right. Words, I'm ready to get back. I'm ready to get in the, the rap game. I'm about to listen to the rap. Get in the pad. I might, I might write some shit right yeah, now. Yeah, I might, I might throw some shit on, man. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, but yeah, man, that's right. just, Good. that's just what we doing right now. Like, more or less, it's just like I'm trying to like. Before I get to the top, I'm turning back around and just grabbing niggas. Oh, yeah, no, nah, that's a fact. That's how you race. That's how you do that. I was just in a change jar 2018. Nigga, like, I'm fucked up, like, nitty shit. Don't worry, my nigga, I'm gonna stay at it. You know what I'm saying? That's a fact. Word up. That's it. You know what I'm saying? Nitty pulling up on me, bringing me weed and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? Then it's like, shit, anything you need now in the emergency, nigga, is there. Oh, it's there. 100%. You know what I'm saying? Same 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 yeah. Courtesy. Yeah. I can do so. Yeah, they can tell you I was just real right. 2018, I was all the way fucked up. Now, I was just telling Mike Powers, man, I just bought, I just bought my house. Yeah, I see. Oh, wow, that's a blessing. That's a, that's a, that's a blessing, brother. That's a blessing, man. It's well deserved, though. You put in a lot of work, brother. That work is everything. Now it's time for me to open up the door for everybody else, and hopefully they can do the same. What I know, nobody gonna teach niggas that. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Because the companies. They want to do that for you and take that bread from you Yo. and then feed you, you know what I'm saying, a little bit of bread. They're not going to pay you out. He you said the nectar, the nectar of the rosé yeah, one. Yeah, either one. Yup, yup. Either one. Hey, you see how quick that convo flipped from music to what we about to drink next? One. It's yours, Rose. Yeah, get the rose, then, yup. <laughs> the rose, the rosé one. No, no gold, no group. <laughs> they ain't got the rosé. They got the nectar? They got nectar? They got nectar, yeah. They ain't got, they ain't got the nectar. They got to go to go to the 60s, man. Go oh, yeah. Mike Pro's behind the camera yeah. on the set with Fleet. Please tell him, where we at right now? <laughs> my hometown, Hamels, man, Far Rockaway. My homie is still in the road, man, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I mean, Mike Powell's was good, bro. What's going on? What's up with the, you got some new music. I heard some exclusive things. Do you want to talk about it? Ah, uh, yeah, man, we doing um, Rock Marcy next month, you know what I'm saying? Me and Rock Marcy playing some music. We got feature on there. We're you know, gonna definitely holler at the folks, stone bar and shit like that. Then I'm gonna take a month off again. You know, come right back in July. And I'm gonna be my bro uh, Brady Watt. You know what I'm saying? Brady Watt play uh play the bass and shit like that. That's what's saying? up. Yeah, that's yeah. some crazy yeah. shit on that album. Too, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I got one of his first verses, so we're gonna see how that goes. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to Lil Fame. We got Fame on there. Nasty cut. Yeah, yeah. And you already know we working, man. I can't really tell you offhand what we doing, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm fucked up. It's a lot. It's night, a lot. You know and congrats on the new baby. Ah, oh, man. Definitely. I'm pointing on for the little kids, and I'm pointing on for the brothers. You know what I'm saying? Making sure everybody good, man. Up, man. We outside with the homies. Just warming up. You want to talk to the talk to the people about your peoples or yeah, not? Yeah, you already know, man. I grew up with everybody yeah, right here. I'm saying it's all family. Man, it's like, all family. Love, man. Yeah, like yeah, yeah, yeah. We appreciate he what he doing. He, he home. home. Like. You know?
Pulling up home because the real situations went down. My family said I lost my mom's out here. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? My pops, you know what I'm saying? He's doing what he do, but my pops, you know, hard life growing up, you know what I'm saying? But coming out here bring me back to that. So, you know what I'm saying? That's why I just stuck to what I was doing. And now, look, I'm doing this music shit. We turn it up. We're going to create opportunities for everybody to get recognition and get some bread, you know what I'm saying? Right up. And this is where it all started at, right? This is definitely where it all started at. This is where I, this is where I grew up at, you know what I'm saying? Shit, you know what I'm saying? Met a lot of good brothers that still a part of my life. You see what they doing right here. Oh shit. And it's a whole lot more, you know what I'm saying? Like a whole lot. We ain't even gonna go in all of it right now, you know what I'm saying? We not gonna even go over there right now, but definitely, you know what I'm saying? Like this. Definitely go over there right now. Oh yeah, we can, but we don't wanna walk right now. It's brick as fuck. We out here just sipping, trying to, you know, warm up a little bit, you know what I'm saying? This was just me popping up with my brothers and they came outside to kick it with us, you know what I'm saying? Last minute shit, like, you know what I'm saying? Four brothers, they out here, they, they doing what they do, they pull up, you know what I'm saying? So, you already know what it is, man. Far Rock, it's my hometown, man. Put on, man. RP stacks, RP chicks. So check, this was just a preview for y'all. Let me tell you what I learned when I connected with Flea. I wanted to see if he was the same guy from the interview. The same humble, down-to-earth guy people keep telling me about. Yeah, he was most certainly that. He treated me as a brother and I didn't see no frowns when Flea was seeing people. I'm talking from Manhattan to Dykeman to Brooklyn to Queens. It was all love. Flea put on for his people. I witnessed this. And that answered a lot of questions about how this guy continues to win despite all the hate. It's his energy. Positive. Transparent. Honest. Tune back into this channel in the coming weeks for a fuller expose on the Lord Mob General, Flea Lord. We about to tell the truth about who he is and where he comes from. Thank you for connecting with me. Now, go connect with each other. What's poppin' is your boy Mike with Howard Sniper. The intro king. It's the Howard The almighty. The best in the fucking game. Can you hear me? The mic, 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 the